every word has got different meaning information has got different meaning knowledge has got different meaning wisdom has got different meaning and enlightenment has got different meaning you can't mix up these words a word is created for a specific meaning so when you want to use a specific word you must understand the word meaning of it then only use it so remember that every word is a distinct character every word has got specific meanings related to them for the for the meaning for the word information it is different the word knowledge is different the word wisdom is different the word enlightenment is different so everything is important in the parts of the body which is more important eyes or hands or legs which is more important in the inside body whether it is the liver or the kidneys or the intestine which is, which part is important baba everything is important information is important then knowledge is important then wisdom is important then enlightenment is important everything begins with information you don't have knowledge but you are informed for the first time that there is something like that supposing you are a chemistry student first of all you, you are informed about chemistry what is an acid what is an alkali then you slowly your knowledge increases about chemistry then you become a wise person in chemistry you become a professor in chemistry you become a master in chemistry you become a professor then finally you make your own experiments in chemistry you find out some new formulas new chemicals that is the enlightenment stage in chemistry similarly when you are a student of music first time you are going to a music college music guru first time you are singing something some raga some sarigama padanisa you don't know what is sa what is re what is ga but the first time you are learning about them you are having information first you slowly you will have knowledge which raga is what which tara is what then you will be very wise person you can you can perform for the public then finally you are enlightenment mean you can become like tyagaraja you can f- contribute new 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 ragas new compositions to the whole field of music tyagaraj is an enlightenment stage in music leonardo da vinci is in the enlightenment stage of painting so in the enlightenment they contribute as a new creation they add to the whole scheme of things their own personality which was never before existing that is the highest stage is enlightenment the initial first stage is information the second stage is knowledge the third stage is wisdom condensed knowledge is wisdom new experimentation new creativity new contribution to the whole scheme of things is enlightenment so these are the four words you you spoke about two words i am speaking about four words information knowledge wisdom and enlightenment people are at these various stages many people are not at all even informed about spirituality they don't know what is spirituality there, there is no information at all there are many people like that now they should seek information they should be given information about what is spirituality then after being informed they have to acquire knowledge they have to gather all the facts they have to study hard to become knowledgeable abundance of information is knowledge a scarcity of knowledge is called information then they should apply that in their day to day lives that is wise wisdom whatever knowledge they have they should apply then they are called wise persons in their day to day life then they should contribute significantly in that field to the whole world 
they should contribute their own achievements. For example, in the field of music, new ragas, new compositions, like Swati Thirunal, Parandra Dasa, Tyagaraja, Beethoven, Mozart. Then in the field of meditation, you should be able to contribute something new. So even in enlightenment, there are highly enlightened people. In information, there are highly information, informed people. In knowledge, there are highly knowledgeable people. In wisdom, there are highly wise people. In, in enlightenment, there are highly enlightened people. All grades are there. Right from information to enlightenment. 